We're making the beautifulest gingerbread house in the whole, whole, whole world. And the beauty will all come down to Nick Kugler, the artistic genius behind this. I don't know where scissors are, but that's what knives are built for. And then what we're going to do... Then we're going to set it ablaze! Woo! Possibly with our hopes and dreams written on little pieces of paper inside it. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Here's me with my wisdom tooth taken out. I feel a little ashamed, Rico, because usually you document like gourmet food with that camera. <laughs> I feel a little weird about this. <laughs> well, the great thing is this has a wonderful ending too, which sometimes I want to do with the food that I eat. <laughs> we did it last year because I, don't, I think we like acquired a gingerbread house and then we like added on to it, making it increasingly hideous. <laughs> and um, and then everyone was like, no, no one, no one wants to eat this or keep it. What should we do? We were like, lighter fluid! <laughs> that was it, the key moment oh, in which I'm we sorry. decided none of us wanted to eat it. A real camera? <laughs> what? I know, he's... <laughs> Can you tell me about his nose? His nose is, um, um, actually I think what happened is he flew into a finch. He was attempting to be Thomas the Tank Engine, the flying version, and as he took off, he was actually rotating, coming back down to Earth as fast as he could fly, smack right into a finch. <laughs> And it, wow. his, hence his nose is yellow and finch looking. It actually looks a little bit phallic. That's, that's what I was wondering about. <laughs> uh, Stella's name is spelled with an I? No. To know. Oh, yeah, this guy. S T E L L I. You try using the tiny thing. I, I'm about to. I'm sure it's going to be hard. I feel is like it's smart to do this in the morning. Uh, this is the developer uh, oh. of the oh, energy no. company that has poisoned no, the river. The river is toxic. You see that there's now creepy mutant fish in it. And these are the sheep. The sheep are poised to take back their land. You could do it, sheep. And this one's got, he's reading, and we got a, it's a multi-generational group of folks. We got some young guys. We've got an elder here at the top. It's an uprising. It is. They're fighting back for what's theirs. And then... It looks like Thomas, the homicidal tank engine, is heading toward Rico. Oh my, oh my god, actually it looks like my dentist is working on it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to hurt. <laughs> really? <laughs> Liar! And then you've got to get Nick's tiki torches out front. Oh my god. So what, what is this face? And there's also it, another mutant sheep there. Yeah, it's just a prison. Uh, it's a prison? It's a prison. And you got the tiki torches here. And then there's this one sheep right there. That is the most delicious prison I have ever seen. <laughs>